Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to some more Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. Last time, we defeated the Yiga Clan in the Yiga Clan hideout, and this time, we've got some more stuff in the overworld to do. Yeah. So let's start off by going to the shop and buying all of oh. the Octo Balloons. Oh. So I can do that other quest over here. In case of, em in case of emergency, safety inspectors have determined that many outposts lack uh, buoys for peop people to use in the event of a flood. Maybe you can provide a suitable a substitute of some kind. I've done it. The Octorok materials made for perfect flotation devices. Between the original buoys and your own monster based alternatives, all the outposts were now well equipped for emergency for an emergency. Zelda gets two extra hearts. And Zelda's apparently the first character to get a second work on a second row of hearts. I think if it's the same rules as Breath of the Wild, it means that there are 15 in a row. I'm not going to sit here counting. It's either 15 or 10 in a row. Anyway, what else is available? Well, obviously this. Uh, but I can't do it because it's not actually available. Why was it giving me... Why was it pointing it to, out to me if I'm not going to be able to do it? I don't know. But anyway, let's have a look at this. A Goron style uh, massage. The Gorons want to offer Goron style massages as an amenity for the miners up on Death Mountain. Help assist uh, amass funds to build a massage parlor to soothe the workers. Stiff shoulders. There we go. The Goron City Massage Parlor opened for business. The first client to get a massage was the Great Daruk himself. He seems to be the first thing for everything, isn't he? With, the, he? with his muscles loosened up, he was sure to fight even better. Two bonus hearts for Daruk. All well, very nice, and he's the second person to get in his second row. Oh hey, Elden Reach level 1. Got some Hylian Rice and some Goron Spice. It's very nice. A leaf on the breeze. One of the Koroks is upset because no matter how hard they spin their leaf, they can't seem to fly like their siblings. They should not They should try using fire to create an updraft. That'll get them off the ground. Riding on eddies of warm air above the crackling fire, the Koroks sailed through the sky with ease. With practice, they became an expert. They even taught Hester a bit about the art of flying. Hester gets an extra bonus combo. Landing a champ- oh, Lording a champion. To celebrate Mifa's appointment as a champion, a grand festival is being held in Zora's domain. Collect some luminous stones to add a splash of color to the prece proceedings. In the soft light of the many limerick stones, Mifa herself seemed to glow when the festival had reached a close. She apparently took one, of, one as a memento and used it to adorn her living quarters. Mifa gets an extra heart which pushes her over to the second row. A balm for the soul. A girl you met in your travels is homesick for Kakariko village. Uh, coconut concoct a new dish that will remind her of home. You did well. After trial and error, you came up with a recipe for carrot stew. K um, Kakariko Village loves its carrots, and so did the girl. She's homesick no longer, and you have a new recipe. Charge special per enemy KO. That's useful. Okay, I think... That's about everything that's flashing at the moment that we can actually do, probably. So anyway, there's a few markers I'm going to have to mark. <laughs> Seems a bit redundant to say that, but anyway. We're going to need to do some challenges, so... Defend the Sands. Main enemies, looks like Suga. Some Yika Blade Masters, Fire... What's it called? And... Yeah. <laughs> I probably don't need to actually explain all that. Anyway, recommended level 34. Let's go into it. And see how we go.
116. That's a lot of main quests. Well, side quests. Also, the traveling merchants, I don't know if that's actually helping me. But it's fine. Okay, let's go. Defeat Suga. Okay. I'll do that then. You want to take this ground? Come on then, fight for it. I'm guessing I can't let the allied keep fall. Allied outpost. Yeah, allied stronghold, that's the word. Not fair, not at all. Or fight fair, or not at all. Okay. Behold our splendor. Oh, well, he needs Coronas now. Ow, 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 ow. Come on. You know what, I'm gonna just leave you for a second because the allied stronghold is not looking too good because it's got a few things inside of it already. I don't want to lose it, so let's go up here and defend. Oh, there's a bomb. Let's blow that up. There we go. Oh, that actually weakened the Eager Blade Master. So fire must be the weakness. Weak point smash. Easy. There's another one. Let's heal, and let's use fire. That didn't work, okay. Never mind then, I think it possibly just... Suggests... Whatever. Anyway. Come on. Come on! Not quite, that's fine. Oh, there's another one. Well, okay then, let's weak point smash you. Switching to the other one. Ow. Let's use our special, because we have two. There's another Yiga Blade Master? What is this? Weak point smash! Okay, there we go. Let's head for this other Blade Master. Okay, special. An enemy has made it inside the Allied Stronghold? Really? I had no idea. Come on, so close. Okay, weak point smash. There we go. That should be everything around the place that was going to cause me trouble. I might actually go take out some of those Fire Wizard ropes so I can actually get some element. Probably a good plan. Suga might be weak to it, possibly, which is why they're here, but I don't really know that for certain. Please, hit him. Oh, bomb. There we go. And let's weak point smash. I guess I can also fight the other uh, Fire Wizard Robe because I think if I defeat them they'll give me stuff that might be useful for overworld stuff. Allied Stronghold is doing really well. It's barely taken any significant damage. Okay, Fire Wizard Robe. Let's take you out. Oh, you need a bomb. I don't think I'm going to hit you. Nope, I did. Let's try to take you down. Weak point smash. There we go. Let's go finish this off and defeat Suga. There's a lot of area that's available for this. For some reason. Yuga Blade Master appeared. Oh no, I just cleaned those up. Come 
Come on. If I can defeat Suga quickly enough, it probably won't be a problem. Come on, weak point smash. An enemy has made it into the weak, the allied stronghold. Probably want to go actually get those. Okay, let's go do it. Even though I don't really want to. I don't want to lose this just for random reasons. Why are there red dots on the map now? Probably spawning more enemies that are going to try and take this outpost. Stasis. Nice. Weak point smash. Okay. Come on. Let's use our special. And you're gone... almost. Come on. A little bit more, there we go. Oh my goodness, so many extra enemies. Hopefully they can just survive on their own. And I'm gonna go up this way. And try to take out Suga again. Since that didn't work out the first time yet, so... Here, yeah, I might also... Do that. Do that a little bit. Where is he? There he is. Strike lightning. And just keep attacking. Doing well. Ow. Come on, so close. To a weak point smash. There we go. That also gives me back my electricity, so I'll strike some lightning on him. Blow you up. There we go. Oh, please actually hit him. Come on. Oh, freeze. Oh, nice. What? No. He aims for you. Oh my goodness. That's really annoying. That works. Oh, please, 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 please. No, missed it. By that much. Ow. There we go. We point smash. He's done. Allied stronghold, stronghold was kept safe. There we go. Just like that. Level 36. I think that's the highest level we have. Which is surprising because it's not Link. Okay, what's next? What is left? I did, there wasn't a ton of things that unlocked when we beat the previous level. So let's see what's left. There's a few things we can do. Oh, it just unlocked more things. Okay then. Well, I think... I think... Let's take out... Have, have a look at this other mission down here. A feast for whiz robes. Let's switch over to probably Link since it's, he doesn't get much time when I'm trying to do challenges and stuff, so 
Let's go ahead and look at this, and this will be a good chance to actually build up my element. Especially if I do this before any of the major battles, because that means I can just recharge all my element just before a main battle, so. It's very good that we're unlocking this. I'm so glad that the main story missions load faster than the actual side challenges. Probably has something to do with limiting space to small areas. Possibly? I don't really know, but anyway. Oh my goodness! 17 whiz robes in 10 minutes. I could use element to make this go by faster, but I'm not sure how it's going to work overall. Go Link, go Link, go Link, weak point smash! Okay, let's focus on this next whiz robe. Let's see if I can take him out fairly well without actually using element. I can also use... nope, not that. Go back, back. I can also use bombs, especially if he needs it. There we go, weak point smash. Keep going. Okay. Electric whiz robes. Oh, it's so nice playing as Link again. He's just so strong. Also, putting two whiz robes next to each other doesn't seem to be much of a problem. Where is he? There he is. Come on. Oh, so good. Blow you up. I know these patterns far too well at this point. Weak point smash. Let's keep going. A gate has opened. I wonder where that could be. Also, yes, this is definitely going to be a good mission to just recharge element on. I don't know about food, but element's pretty good. Especially if we can upgrade how much we can hold. Okay, weak point smash. Link looks really good in the sunset. Now, oh, come on. Oh, one of them needs bombs. Both of them needs bombs. Well, th just that one. Okay. But anyway, let's finish you up. We put smash. Okay, let's take you out. Come on. Oh, he needs bombs. I don't know if I can hit him from here. Yeah, there's nothing to, to make that easy. There we go, weak point smash. That's a pretty good number of enemies defeated already. We have seven and a half minutes to defeat the rest. Ten remaining, okay. Three fire wizard ropes coming up. I don't know for certain, but possibly. Oh my goodness, that's not the one I was trying to do, and that one needs bombs. Ah, uh, that one. That one needs bombs now. Let's do that one. Good, 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 good. I wonder if I can use Creonus in this water. Possibly, but also unlikely. Makes it easier to just hit him in the face, though. Weak point smash! Okay, let's get this fire whiz rope. Come on! Not quiet, and he's gonna want bombs. 
Nice, 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 nice. Oh, weak point smash. Just like that. There we go. And level up. Nice. Very good. Let's take a few of these wizard robes out. Let's use our special. We have two specials. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. Oh, so amazing. Oh, so good. Please let me hit him. Just a little bit more. Okay then, let's just use our special then. This is going to take out one or two. Maybe. Oh, there's these two left. Please let me take you out. Oh, there's another one behind me. No, three behind me. Or two. That's the correct number behind me. Come on. Oh, he wants bombs and he's in the air. He's not going to have enough time to get him. Yeah, that's a shame, but... So close to actually being... Weak point smashed anyway. Weak point smash. And last one. Let's go get him. You don't really think you're going to last that long, do you? Oh my goodness. Camera. Doing a full spin. Full 360. Nope, not quite. But it's almost there anyway. Oh, weak point smash. Here we go. There's so much element just all over the place. There we go. And also, I think that was pretty good for a little bit of food as well. That was fun. Okay, then. Link always is fun, though. Okay. More things. Okay, and that's about it for this episode of Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.